So I had some questions on that whole root menu thing. Um, so best thing to do is go to settings. And um, basically the root menu is that menu inside of, you know, not any of this stuff here. But you have to go down to about device. And then MRI, hit the gear. This is what I call the root menu or boot menu. This is all the little bit more serious stuff. So, I mean, you got the radio. Um, the, I changed the zone, changed that to the US, la la, this and that. Um, I changed my FM. I could probably do FM1 because I really don't listen to it. I put it to one and two, so you basically have, have two FM stations. Um, kind of did all that stuff, left the rest there. But then um, the one question I had is I, I was able to get my um, forward track and reverse, reverse track, you know, back and forward. I was able to get that switched just like your doors if you find out that the doors are opening wrong you can swap them same for the rear doors your trunk hood with the up down key right there swap that's how i got my keys to change for um the next track so and then like just like i talked about before you have the temperature right there 75 degrees um got that there and then that's actually right there off and on if you turn it off and then go out it'll shut it off but I like having that on. See it on the radio. I look at the radio more than my dash usually. So, but then here, um, quick way to get to the boot logo, you know, going in here. Shows everything here. You can do a search or you have all the ones that were preloaded on it. There's the bow tie. Um, you got GMC, all those in there. Um, screenshot mode, no clue what that is. But you got a whole bunch of other stuff. Your display, different brightnesses and stuff for the display. But there's a lot in here that you can mess with. Um, so just take your time, learn your radio. Each radio is different. I have the 9480 and I'm getting a lot of questions, um, on messenger and stuff like that. People are asking me, but I don't have the same radio as them. So if they had the 9380, it was a totally different setup. So you've got to take the time and learn your radio. I can't help you. I can just tell you what I know about my radio. Um, and even get on the groups, Google it. Um, Eonin has some pretty good information on their website. Um, even through Facebook, you can get some stuff there on their group. Um, you, you just got to look. I really, you know, I'm, I'm still learning this radio. So just wish you all luck. I haven't had a whole lot of problems. I do get a little bit of the, the static everybody's talking about. But it's really, really quiet. I haven't noticed it. But I did notice um, changing like the frequency and stuff to the radio back in, I think it was in here. You can try to maybe adjust some stuff and see if you're noticing it. See if that changes anything. So, you know, worst you can do is go back in and rechange it. So, um, hope that helps everybody. If you have any more questions, just let me know. I'll try to do my best to help. But like I said, I can, you know, I'm only going to be any good on the, the 9480 radio. But still have gotten nowhere on the CarPlay with the dongle. The dongle just seems to be more of a pain in the ass than anything. But um, I do have my factory cable in here now. Um, got that plugged in. I got the factory adapter hooked up to run. And I just have this cable here. Didn't change a single thing on it to do um, like mirroring or anything like that. Waiting to hear back from Iana because they said that the dongle should help it. Well, obviously it didn't. Um, so not really sure what's going on. Uh, it's just getting really annoying. I mean, that's the main reason why I bought this radio was to have all that stuff set up on it. So, I guess we will have to see what we come up with on it. So, but yeah, and then yeah, you can see, you just have to take your time with the screen. It'll, it'll go. That's the, one of the only glitches that I found with the radio. If you white swipe too fast, it won't pick up on it. But, um, another thing in there too that I did notice, and uh, nah, I'll scratch that. Well, I'll do another video for that. But kind of found some different options in there when you look up the apps. Before, I didn't have iPod on there. Um, that was something that I added. I added Android Auto. So you can change these in here in the root menu back at the beginning. So now when I click iPod, it straight up shows my iPod over there. I don't know if it'll play. I might have to go into the glove box and kick it on. Uh, it's another stupid thing i hate with this radio i don't really get it but um every time you have to do that it won't just play or go to the next track or anything like that so most part i've been doing bluetooth through that bluetooth through, through my phone and so on thanks